on this Saturday night is uh, no such random newbie. No, she is not. She's been around. Uh, and, and as we discussed off air, she has actually been here on Red's Room the exact same amount of time as I have been here on Red's Room because uh, she got asked to perform on Red's Room and she said only on one condition if he hosts it. And guess who's been here ever since? But I could say the same thing. She's been here ever since as well. Red just can't get rid of either one of us now, nor would he want to, I guess, because you know we're doing live events and stuff. So, I mean, it's been a good thing. So, uh, but she is from Spencer, Massachusetts. She just got done performing, of course, along with Right Hand Shade at the Hope for Worcester Gala in Worcester, Massachusetts. She is a contemporary Christian artist. She has grown up leading worship at her home church, Holden Chapel, since the age of 12. Her music reflects her relationship with God and her journey through faith. Since writing her first song in 2019, she has played in cafes, churches, and drive-in shows all across New England, alongside such artists as Right Hand Shade, Saved by Scarlet, Crimson Rain, Rachel DeLong, Sam Bowen, and more. The list goes on. Please welcome once again to the Red's Room stage. She is also known for dropping a random Veggie Tales song every once in a while on here. Here's Kat Stewart. Kat, good evening. Good evening. How are you, Jill? <laughs> I am good. How are you doing tonight? great <laughs> good uh what have you been up to uh other than the hope for worcester gala which was a success last week what else musically have you been up to since the last time you've joined us here on red's room wow since the last time i'm not sure <laughs> i'd have to go back um been that recording long? a lot mostly mostly uh in the studio finishing up some some final touches on the album getting uh some new stuff in already it's a constant cycle for anyone who does music you know it's it's a constant rotation you're always writing you're always recording you're always just kind of working on that even before the next thing is out which for me is my first thing so we're taking our time um so is the album getting closer to where you want it as far as a, a final product or we or is the light at the end of the tunnel when it comes to that <laughs> We are the closest we've ever been and probably, you know, the farthest we'll ever be ever again. Let's get philosophical with it, you know. Um, yeah, it's we're, pretty We're close. getting deep with this answer here all of a sudden. We're getting pretty close to, to finalizing everything. So, yep. Very nice. Very nice. And we look forward to it. It's It's been long awaited around here. Yeah, yeah. Same here. <laughs> no, I know it's been for you since about the time I've known you. It's been long awaited. So uh, yes. I know for sure. Yes, indeed. Uh, what is your first tune you got for us? <laughs> um, well, you did say that there was a light at the end of the tunnel. So now I feel obligated. Oh. Um. <laughs> This is going to be the, the magical night of Red's room where Joe picks all of my songs with words, he says. Um, oh, is this what it is? Okay, apparently I did the first one, apparently. So, um, this first song I did write during that kind of that first time when I was just sitting at home during COVID and we were all just kind of twiddling our thumbs a little bit, not knowing what the next move was going to be, if we could go outside again or <laughs> go back to work. And so I wrote this song just about looking forward to um, the light at the end of the tunnel and just being able to keep our hope and our focus on Jesus instead of the chaos that kind of surrounds everything. Um, especially in everyday life, I get so distracted and you can check me on this on my Instagram this morning. I had to post for social media and I was just thinking and thinking and what came to my mind almost instantly was Psalm 121 and it says, I lift my eyes up to the hills. Where does my help come from? My help comes from the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. And for me, it's really easy when I start to get in that rut to 
focus either straight ahead or what's behind me, like what's chasing me, right? And sometimes you just take a breath and you look up and, and look to Jesus for that. So without any more longer introductions, I promised that I would keep this short. I'm already seeing the comment section going, so. <laughs> oh, right. you are? Oh, you, you mean, I am. mean the nonsense of um, <laughs> play something already, play Goodbye play Horses, already. and um, shouldn't you just always play video games? You mean that type of comments from one such individual? I, you know, known for maybe creating connections <laughs> where your concerns around here. Is Goodbye Horse as a song though? Or is that just made up? I, like I, don't, I don't know. We'll find out. I feel it's like fine. if anybody could make one up, you probably could, but yeah. <laughs> well, all right, I'm gonna play the song now. <laughs> okay, play play the song, cat. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Shattering every hope and darkening every light. I can't see five minutes ahead. I can't sort out my life. I'm running as fast as I can. Is the finish side of sight? This mountain's too tall, and I'm wearing thin. I can't see what's left from right. But there's a light at the end of the tunnel. There's a peace that I can't understand. And there's a God on his throne up in heaven, and his spirit takes my hand. And there's a promise being brought through. A mercy with no flaws. My Savior's grace has no, no limits. He spent my life upon that cross. So when I'm blocked on every side, when every bridge is turned to ash, when we're staying in friends fail, and I get stuck in the past. I know that there's a light at the end of the tunnel. There's a peace that I can't understand. And there's a God on his throne up in heaven. And his spirit takes my hand. And there's a promise being brought through. A mercy with no flaws. My Savior's grace has no, no limits. He spared my life upon that cross. So bring on the fire. My God will stand with me. Yeah, bring on the floodways. My God will part the seas. Yeah, bring on the fire. My God will stand with me. Bring on the floodways. My God will part the seas. Cause there's a light at the end of the tunnel. There's a peace that I can't understand. And there's a God on his throne up in heaven. And his spirit takes my hand. And there's a promise being brought through. A mercy with no flaws. My Savior's grace has no, no limits. He spared my life upon that cross. Joe's distracted again. That is. Looking at some of the comments here. That is uh, Cat Stewart there. Always a favorite to that song. And that song is going to be on the album, is it not? It is. Yes. Yep. It is. Um, that among many of my pandemic writing is. Uh, it's going to be on this this album. I'm very excited. I'm excited for it. At this point, um, I feel like a lot of that that kind of time frame has been encapsulated in that in the album of just you know looking for 
hope and a purpose when you're kind of stuck and you can't do anything, you know? So I feel like I have to check these comments too now. I have them in front of me, so <laughs> I have fun. <laughs> I do. <laughs> oh my. Yeah, um with the great girl with the guitar. Oh my girl with the guitar. Girl with the guitar. I, the, these are these oh my word. <laughs> Just here, just here to hate on my second biggest hater. Yeah, Tom who? I don't know. Oh, nah. Geez. <laughs> <laughs> nah, Tom is, Tom is great. Except for when he tells me to sing about saying goodbye to horses, because I don't want to do that. Why would I say goodbye? He says goodbye, I say hello. Okay? That's what it is. You just put a song. I did. <laughs> I'm glad someone got it. You say goodbye and I say hello. Hello, I hello. Say hello. Hello, hello. Don't know why you say goodbye. I say hello. Yeah, end on G. When in doubt. Anyways. <laughs> so, of course, now I could now see you put pressure on me though, because now, now I feel like I have to like allude to like the next song somehow. What song? In what song is and I don't know what word I'm going to say to, to trigger it. You know, um, you'll come up with something. You see, I mean, see, that's the thing. I mean, I mean, if somebody has to know tonight that they are fearfully and wonderfully made, right? Oh. Uh, oh, oh, wait a minute. <laughs> All right. Oh. That's fine. Tom who? <laughs> Tom who? All right. Hmm. Yeah, so. I, 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 don't, I don't think yeah. a Tom guy had anything to do with this song, did he? Tom who? Yes. Um, right. Song I wrote all by myself. All by myself. Another all song by, reference. All by, my... all by myself. Yes. Um, no, this that song um, I wrote with Tom, and it was a blast. It came from um, a CMS hangout, actually. I had never met Tom before, never heard like heard anything one way or the other. And we all got on this call, and I remember this so, so well. We were just talking, and you know what? You know what? what? We were all just talking. Uh huh. Uh huh. I cleaned out some boxes today. Guess what I found? Oh, uh, what did your your poker face? What else did you find? Oh, you did. <laughs> So this, this was what I drew on a piece of paper. It's now laminated. I did laminate it for the doubt. You did laminate it. Um, it is laminated. It is laminated, okay. And this was my poker face. And we we got to, to talking, like getting a little deep about a joke, just saying, you know, how we put on poker faces all the time and we, really try hard to pretend either we have it all together, we don't make mistakes, we're confident, etc. Whatever your poker face may be. And Except Tom was like, we should write a song yours. about that. Except you're always a little late in your timing with yours. I am terrible with my timing. I will react and then put it up, which is great. Um, it, it makes for I'm, great entertainment that way, actually. I'm sure there's a metaphor in there somewhere. But basically, we came Not up wrong. with a yeah like as a as the poker face song and so just this idea that we don't have to be that way with god um because the way that we are and the things that we try to hide are intentionally designed by a creator who loves us and who wants us that way and it was such a cool idea. We sat down, we wrote it out, and it's uh, 
is also going to be on the album, speaking of. And it's one of my favorite songs to play and, and sing out. And uh, yeah, Tom, Tom and I uh, kind of sat down, worked through it all. And uh, this, is, this is what it sounds like, I guess. This song is called Fearfully oh. and Wonderfully Made. So in case you, you did not know. So is it subtitled the Poker Face song? I might. Yeah, this is the Poker Face song. It's great. <laughs> Well, I'm so tired of the heart And I'm so done with all this faking Till you make it I know it's time to make some changes This mask I'm wearing No, it don't fit anymore Oh, it's time Time to be real and let these walls come tumbling down. I'm free, free to be me. And there's no more shame, no, because I know the truth. I'm fearfully and wonderfully made. So I won't lay all my past to you, find me. And I won't be afraid of my mistakes yet, cause I'll make them. And I will trust you with my weakness. And I'll keep chasing after who I'm meant to be. Cause it's time, time to be real. And let these walls come. Tumbling down, I'm free, free to be me. And there's no more shame, no, cause I know the truth. I'm fearfully and wonderfully made. So I don't have to be perfect. I know that you're still working. It's Time to step out the shadows, let your light shine so the whole world can see that I don't have to be perfect. I know that you're still working. It's time to step out the shadows, let your light shine so the whole world can see you in me. Yeah. Oh, it's time, time to be real. And let these walls come tumbling down the wind's time, time to be real. And let these walls come tumbling down, I'm free, free to be me. And there's no more shame. Cause I know the truth I'm fearfully and wonderfully made Ah Yes, indeed. Fearfully and wonderfully made. Yes, indeed. See, now I like it just as it is, of course, but that Tom, Tom who jokingly says I think I might have to rewrite this one. <laughs> What are we rewriting it to? <laughs> how about no, Tom? Tom goes. How about it's time to be real and never sing Waymaker again. Oh no! Yes. Oh no. Um. Oh my uh, goodness. Nas says the foursome. That was the foursome. Yeah, hangout where that all got started. Mary yes. Harris. Everyone who knows Cat Stewart knows that she is a seriously cute human. Thanks. Who said that? <laughs> what? That was Mary. Mary. Oh, thanks, Mary. Oh, my word. Desiree <laughs> says that that's a beautiful song you wrote, Kat. Yes, Thank indeed. You. It is. Yes, Thank indeed you it very is. much. Wendy says. I didn't just write so it, though. That is a co write. Tom did, in oh. fact, sit down. We wrote that together. That was all hatched from CMS. 
Oh, uh, so how long did that one take to, to, since you already sort of had the framework of essentially right. hang out what you wanted to say, was that one pretty quick to sit down and flesh out and, and yeah, write? yeah, I think we did two rights on that one. So we met a couple hours for two days and just kind of hashed it out, got like the, the body work, the skeleton of it. And then once we had that, we just went in, we, we added all the parts and the elements that we wanted to say and uh, took off from there. It was great. Was awesome. <laughs> I have I have heard of a couple of songs that this 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 program this platform CMS has been responsible for at least in part. That being one of them, and I remember what was that? I think you uh, when I was out at the mill at your concert, I think you surprised me with that I did, for the first yeah. time. Like <laughs> little do you know that this is where it came from. I was just like, what? Such the coolest thing. I was just yes. like that something that you spearhead be responsible for creative music to come out of it I mean that's bigger than anything I yeah. think that I ever thought that um it would reach to that levels where now songs are being made um out of topics discussed or programming that's happening I mean that wasn't that the only one either I mean it's just like every time that that happens is, is so cool and so little miracles little three minute miracles little three minute mir yeah that's what songs <laughs> are right little three minute that's why they have such a wide ranging impact for all of us and music can certainly be uh healing in a lot of ways um yeah. to our spirit and to our soul because it, it, music serves that that type of purpose for sure um now you just played hope for worcester of course what is yes. next for you um in the next few months what uh, is there going to be even more songwriting because you're always writing of course is there going to be yeah. more songwriting coming do you have a few more uh, performance dates lined up this summer what's your summer look like so far i do have performance dates lined up they've already gone in the brain to the calendar and out so if <laughs> anyone <laughs> This is my life, okay? I'm a teacher. It, it happens. Um, it, it, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it will all be online. It'll be announced before I head out to play anywhere. So just keep well, an eye on the hope social so, media. You want people to show up. I mean, hmm? I said we would hope so because you'd want people to show up at these things. Yes, yes. I would, I would assume. <laughs> Yes. I would love to meet you all. Actually, yeah, it's been fun. Some of some of the places I've I've gotten to play um, over the past couple couple of months, like people from CMS have come up and been like, "I watch you all the time. It's so good to meet you." I'm like, "Oh my gosh!" Oh, like they, just like you, Joe. Like they're no longer just the face in a box. It's great. I love that. Oh, <laughs> that is amazing. That is amazing. Yep. Oh, yes. So hello, Joe and Red. And head. hello, Monica. How you doing? Nice to see you. Great to have you here tonight. Uh, <laughs> Tom says it's called Pew Pew Pew. Pew Pew Pew. <laughs> is there something I've never done that about? live. Is there something, is there something I should know back. about this? Hmm? Is there an inside joke there that I should know about this? I mean, yes and no. I am. Yes and no. Okay. I am an avid gamer. And so I'm not very good, but I enjoy doing it. You've and made so an appearance the... on Tom's, um, Tom Who's um, gaming platform once or twice. Tom Who's gaming. Yes. Yeah, so we've done like live streams and, and different things we game. Um, <laughs> and it's a lot of fun, but like it gets crazy. You don't realize how invested you are in a game until you're like, halfway through and you're screaming at each other <laughs> those who don't know cat know that cat is very competitive it's so competitive and i try really hard not to be and so it's worse when it happens i'll always be like no i'm really bad at this and then just like you try very hard not to be i do i i try it's just listen I got good self-control in all the other areas, okay? <laughs> That's what it is. Oh, all right, we'll let that one go then. All right, okay. Oh, I okay. just kind of slipped through the cracks there. Competitiveness. Hmm. 
competitiveness and the ability to have a poker face just no gone that's why i have this though i don't need a that poker is face. that is i don't need a face if i have and this right it again yeah i still i still i see i still say there should be some sort of like posters or merch or something down the line i that, have you know. i have some merch um in the design phase at the moment and oh poker face may or may not be incorporated in that at some point aha aha okay stay tuned i guess i am the greatest gamer i know named tom golly <laughs> i'm tom golly <sighs> Yes. Uh, That's where everyone in the chat goes, no, my name's Tom Dolly. Carry, I'm the carry her to New Jersey. New Jersey? Oh, sure. Liz. Liz has a great question. A question for the audience. Uh, Liz, the other Liz, Liz Perry Reynolds says her Joey, her kid Joey, which is eight years old, wants to know if you've ever recorded a song while playing a game. I'm going to have to do that now. Oh, that's, you have that's not. Cool. Yeah. That is, I, I have not, but I will now. <laughs> but it's, but it's going to happen now. Now it's going to happen. Stay tuned on YouTube. Mary says, "Merch, take my money, please." <laughs> I will gladly, and then I can come out and play wherever you are. Oh, uh, <laughs> good evening. Uh, good evening to you, uh, Elizabeth. The the. Uh, yes the false the, what's false false i don't know what false is hopefully i was hoping you could shed some light into that i have not been following as dutifully as i promised i would be Oops. Uh, I'm, I'm i'm just i'm just i'm just you know thinking what song i should you know reference next oh dear you can't do it like outright though I no like i know because if i'm not care but if i'm not careful though you could be like roped into a song that you know you may not want and then that's true i'll just tell you that be, pick... that would, that'd be bad. <laughs> what i'll just tell you pick another one. Oh, you oh you oh you have veto i'll just be like power. no not that one you have veto power oh okay. i do all right i wrote this song Parsons says hey cat great to see and hear you at the mill in millberry at katie fest you're awesome yes <laughs> oh and, and liz perry reynolds says joey looks forward to this recording all right It'll but be Tom, a Tom who wants, wants to make clear, he says songs are sung often while gaming, but not well or correctly. I mean, <laughs> that's actually true. I do sing when I play. <laughs> um, you really? You just you just come up with random. I mean, do you like no, mix really stuff do. up like, as you're gaming, like, or like do you like? Yeah, no. Out your frustration, or do you I like do. actually like? I do. You do. I really do mostly so that i don't just like embody everything that makes me angry because that like it gets frustrating but i'll be like oh my gosh there's a guy and he's chasing me and he has a better gun than i do please help please help <laughs> like, you like it gets bad i'm telling you <laughs> if, if that isn't random shenanigans i don't know what the heck is oh it's my word it really is although although at, at least I do, what i do screamo i will occasionally my inner pterodactyl what? will come out i'm just looking that what? uh oh yeah like i will just be like <laughs> and like freak why, out <laughs> why, why have we never heard this before um i don't know <laughs> probably the same reason y'all have never heard me rap that's true but we do sometimes uh hear you get hungry and want a cheeseburger why yes you had to do this to me you had to throw you had to throw the veggie tails i already forgot what chords i played earlier just as psa to anyone else um <laughs> i already played the cheeseburger song uh -huh. <laughs> and i just by ear and uh so you're just gonna get the chorus because that's all i can remember 
that I literally played like 20 seconds ago. It's fine. All right. Cause you're his cheeseburger, his yummy cheeseburger. He'll wait for you. Oh, oh he'll wait for you. Oh, oh, you are his cheeseburger, his precious cheeseburger. He'll wait for you. Oh, oh he will wait for you. There you go. Uh, we'll 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 give you one last song for realsies if you want to play a full. Yay. sure. Um, but Tom says uh, you haven't heard this rap before. This because this is a family show, Joe. He's not wrong. <laughs> but Joe, uh, Liz is Joey wants to know if you would play if you play Fortnite. I think yes, you do. I do, I do. Hence the he's running after me. And he has a better gun than I do. <laughs> But yeah. uh, Jess, Jess, good evening, Jess. Jess Buffly says, uh, uh, rap, I think with regards to the rap, because I need this now. Um, no should thanks. We just, should we just back yourself out of this hole now? I'm going to play a song. Oh, Liz Perry Reynolds, <laughs> I think this is before you sung it. Abby 13, she did the cheeseburger song. She's going to be my best friend if she sings it. Well, she just did. And we have We're it on record. Now. That nice she did sing this. <laughs> we shall never forget the cheeseburger song nights on CMS. No, we, we shall not. Ah, there it is. The post singing, Liz says, and commence flipping out by Abby. You just apparently made somebody's day over Yay, there. Yay, we're besties now. I made oh. a friend. I love that. <laughs> Denise says, still eventually want to hear, where is my hairbrush? Yeah. Someday. Someday. But what, what, what final song uh, off of your repertoire are we, we going to play now? Um. So I will end this night just uh, with a song that I most recently uh, just finished up. It's going into the studio relatively soon. Um, and we wrote it off the book of Esther and this idea that even when we are afraid to step into our calling or what we think we're, we're called to do um, is something that we would never be able to do, right? Um, my classic example is music. I am, you know, pretty terrified sometimes to get up in front of people and play songs from my heart that I've written that I know is like kind of that vulnerable, like, you know, piece of my life that I am now sharing with a bunch of people and that's scary and sometimes I'm like nah this isn't what I'm supposed to do and instead of running away from it what Esther does in the story of Esther is um, she prays and she trusts that God is going to protect her and through God's provision he um, he watches over her and she ends up saving God's people and the more you think about it, the more miraculous that is, because that's just so amazing that God can protect us and kind of walk us through, hold our hand through difficult acts of courage and service. And um, that was really what, what we came up with when we sat down to write the song. So the song is called Created for This. Turn off the TV, walk in the street, feels like the world's on fire, and I'm gasoline. I hear the wind blow, I hear the thunder call, feels like it's rolling in. Are we paying attention? And I will see the signs. I will not be blind. I won't stop the rain. I won't turn away. I don't want to feel ashamed. I don't want to run away. And when the waters rise, I won't be afraid. I 
want to fight to stay awake. I'll listen to your voice when you say you're needed here and now. My warrior, don't back down. Your voice will strike with the lightning. You were created for this. So I'll keep my head high Despite what I feel inside When your strength is in me These waves break against me And I will see the signs I will not be blind I won't stop the rain I won't turn away I don't want to feel ashamed I don't want to run away And when the waters rise I won't be afraid I want to fight to stay away I'll listen to your voice when you say you're needed here and now. My warrior, don't back down. Your voice will strike with the lightning. Capture my heart, hold on my soul, Holy Spirit. I feel you taking over. Capture my heart. Hold on my soul, Holy Spirit. I feel you taking over. Capture my heart. Hold on my soul, Holy Spirit. I feel you taking over. Capture my heart. Put a hold on my soul, Holy Spirit. Cause I don't want to feel ashamed. I don't want to run away. And when the waters rise, I won't be afraid. I want to fight to stay away. I'll listen to your voice when you say you're needed here and now. My warrior, don't back down. Your glass will strike with the lightning. Created for this, right here on the Saturday edition of Red Zero. Cat Stewart is here with us. Powerful song, Cat says uh, Josh. Amazing, profound words. Just love it, says Denise. Uh, Lisa, before you started in on that song, was just asking about that particular tune. So I think you apparently made her day because it's really <laughs> you just sung it so uh because she's she was asking in the comments before this like what was that song about esther cat and you just went right into it without oh, even wow. anything so that was fantastic that's um, a bad thing <laughs> um, always seems to happen around here that's for sure um so tell us of course where we can keep up with your uh poker face filled journey uh and continue to stay up on any tour dates performances <laughs> i'm so glad to see that back uh <laughs> it's, it's been far too long since we've seen that on any yep. one of our shows yes it's been located it's been found we so, found it we found it today of all days go figure i know right yeah where might we uh, continue to follow your musical journey and 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 follow up with you and keep tuned to all the latest stuff that I'm sure is going to be coming up in the rest of this year? Yeah, um, any social media, it is uh, the handle Cat Stewart Music, Cat with a K, um, and I'm on Instagram, Cat Stewart Music. I'm on Facebook, Cat Stewart Music um youtube cat stewart music as well and then catstewartmusic.com has a link to any other social media my calendar my tour dates all of those things so 
check it out like subscribe follow me send me a message you know <laughs> um but yeah that's where you can find me it'll all be up there on the internet the internet yes indeed uh cat has been a, a, always a privilege to get to hang out with you and uh you get to um to have your friendship and support over the last several years it's been in years context already yikes <laughs> good these years of in some ways they seem long but in some ways it's, it's just a blip that just went like that it's yep crazy. yeah but, uh, it's much continued blessings and success. I know that you're, I've got some performances coming up. You're a New England favorite and you, you all, of course, are getting down to the end of the light of the tunnel when it comes to getting this music out there. Um, yeah. <laughs> and so, so happy and so glad for you. Hopefully many thank doors you. of opportunity will continue to open for you. And thank you for making time to join us here on the Saturday of Red's Room. Always appreciate you. Yeah, thank you. I appreciate you guys too. Thanks for having me on causing some shenanigans as oh, always. shenanigans are a must i mean that is a prerequisite around here whenever yeah. we get us in the same room that's just it's bound to happen if, if it didn't happen then something would be wrong with us you're not wrong because i mean <laughs> that's why that poker face is sitting there right there because yes. shenanigans yes but yeah. need I mention you did, and I'll, and I'll leave you with this, you did say the other day on our platform something that I, I think could be slogan worthy almost. Shenanigans brings joy. <laughs> you remember, yeah, shenanigans yeah. brings joy. Yeah. Shenanigans brings need, joy. Need, need we say more? It's pretty self-explanatory. I mean, that, that describes shenanigans to a T, if you ask me. I agree. I second that. There we go. All right. Cat Stewart on Resident. Thank you very much. Thank Kat. you. Yes. Thank you, guys. <laughs>